we're going to go back and add in center marks to both of our circles here. To do that, first switch to your center line layer, and you have a button called center mark on your dimension toolbar. Click on the circles, and that'll add two center marks on the center line layer on the front view of your object. Now go back to your dimension layer and we're going to add linear dimensions linear means line to every part of this object. It's as easy as clicking on one corner and clicking on another corner. Go ahead and add those all the way around. Now that we have all of our linear dimensions, we're going to add in an angular dimension. So our angular dimension is marked here. We're just going to click on two lines that form an angle between them. Pull it straight up, and it should give you that angle. And it looks like already this dimension may be out of place you have to be very careful that you click on the correct locations when placing these okay then you can go back and add in radius and diameter dimensions radius is marked both the circle with just an arrow pointing from the center out and diameter is marked with the circle with the arrows pointing from side to side 